broken oh. Some days I feel like I am gifted oh. Some days I feel like am I really did What's good, YouTube, man? It's your boy, VJ from Guardable, and I'm back here with another video for y'all, man. I know 2K23 is coming to an end. None of these build videos getting old because 2K24 coming out, but I'm still working on a builder to take it into next year, playing with builder, you know what I'm saying, getting better at it. So I'm about to drop the best build for beginners on NBA 2K23 because, you know, everybody ain't going to get 2K24 right away. And people still getting 2K23 free. Some people might got money to spend want to make a good build, so let's get into it. Before we get into that, man, like, comment, and subscribe. I'm going to give y'all five seconds. Actually, I'm going to give y'all five, yeah, just five seconds to like the video, man, and subscribe. All right, man, let's get into this video. So to start this build off, we're going to be a small forward. We're gonna be six nine, right? Cause that's the best height. They give you the best badge tiers for slashing, of course. You know, you want that tier, you want that tier one slithery, that tier two limitless takeoff. Seven four wingspan. I'm gonna go uh built body shape, so you could just look strong. You might not be that strong, but you gonna look strong. You feel me? So let's get into it. Get into it, man. First things first, we gonna go to our Duncan. 93 dunk. You know what I'm saying? 93 dunk. They give you gold posted rise, gold limitless takeoff, gold slithery. That's perfect. We gonna go 85 three ball. You know what I'm saying? Silver Agent 3 is gold, green machine. Shit, you got, you get catch and shoot on gold. You get all the badges you need, gold, go. You feel me? If you want to spot up, because this build going to be able to spot up, ISO, do whatever you need to do, man. It's going to be a balanced build for a beginning player. So we're going to go to the pass accuracy, man. You already know where we're going with the pass accuracy. 75. 75 is like the sweet spot. Get the LeBron James passing style. 87 ball control for gold clam breaker. You're going to need that gold clam breaker if you want to get buckets when you're in a bind. You feel me? You know what I'm saying? I'm all about helping the people. So, Clamp Breaker is going to help you get a bucket when you box. I'm not going to lie. You're going to blow past people you shouldn't blow by because you have gold Clamp Breaker. Then we're going to go 75 speed with ball. Then we're going to go 70 interior D, all right? 70 interior D. Just to be able to kind of protect the paint, you know. Give yourself a little leeway. You slide over, you got a chance to get a good contest even with high hands. Even with high hands, you know what I'm saying? Then we're going to go 85 perimeter D. You want that 85 perimeter D to be able to defend guards and people, you know, who dribble. And we want 85 still so we can get we can get gloves silver. Get that silver glove so you can get some plucks. Then I went uh I went 85 block. Well, you can go 87 block, but I went 85 just to make the build balance. You know what I'm saying? Keep the badge points around. But 87 could be good if you want to tweak it a little bit. But I went 85 and I went. I went uh I believe I went um 75 rebound just so you can rebound a little bit, you know. You six nine, you might be down there, you end up snagging a couple boards if you really get at the game. Then I went 70 offensive rebound. So that's our that's how we look right now. I gotta go back to the finishing. Skipped a couple. So we go we're gonna go 76, 76 standing dunk, 75 driving layup, and we're gonna go 75. We're gonna go to it, go to 18, 76 close shot perfect 75 speed 81 excel 75 vert you already got it then we went 90 we went 90 um speed with ball then we're gonna go 70 strength just so you can have a little strength on the bill man you're gonna need that strength no cap you definitely are going to need that strength and, you know you can add free throw a little bit if you if you want to but i didn't add free throw on the build but the build is really finalized i believe I missed the spot because it's still one point, but look, final last to me, you know what we're going to do? Put it on the midi, man. Put it on the midi. Give us 19 shooting badges. You feel me? Let me put the rest on the free throw, 69 free throw. Let's go, man. When I made the build the first time, they compared me to the perfect players you want to have be compared to, you know what I'm saying? If you if you want to be an all-around beginning player so you could shoot, dribble, defend, rebound, Scottie Pippen, Jason Tatum. LeBron James, literally three of the best small forwards talents to play the game. Scotty Pippen, the Hall of Famer. LeBron's going to the Hall of Fame. Just tell him on his way to the Hall of Fame, and they all can play, make a little bit, defend, rebound, shoot, get to the basket. That's what you want. The type of you want if you're a beginning player. You want to be able to do it all because you're not going to be the best at a certain thing. So you want to be able to spot up for people if they need it, or you want to be able to play point guard if you're playing with people on the same level as you and they're not as good as you. Stuff like that, man. But other than that, man, VGF Unguardable is out. Make sure y'all like and comment and subscribe to the video. I love all the love and support, man. Stay tuned for 2K24. Much love to y'all.
slipping oh. Some days I feel like I am gifted oh. Some days I feel like I'm I really did 